hands and knees. One minute. When it beeps, you'll rest in a child's pose. Walk your hands a little bit forward. Three, two, one. Here we go. Dip your hips. Lift it along through the top of the head. Brace the abs a little bit. Wave back into a child's pose. That little stretch there is going to feel good. Wave yourself back into upward dog. Stretch out those abs. Twenty seconds left. <clears throat> in five seconds, it beeps. You can sit back in your child's pose and rest there. All right, so you can just relax your arms or you can reach them long away from you and get a little stretch through the upper body, your choice. Take three more deep breaths. And then I'm gonna have you press up onto hands and knees. And then I want you to take one leg and put it straight out to the side. Inner edge of that foot is on the floor and you can scooch away there if you want and kind of open those hips a little bit more. So that leg that you're on the knee does not have to, you don't have to be hip right over it. Get the inner thighs open and then rock forward and back. And then push back. So sit back, butt toward your heel. You can go to your elbows if you want. Sometimes that's more comfortable. Stay there. Go ahead and push yourself back up. Bring that leg in. Other leg goes out to the side. Open those hips a little bit. Once you get in position, rock forward and back. You can also think of this as a little bit of stretch and mobility on the wrists for this rocking part too. You're rocking your shoulders forward past your fingertips. That can be good for us as well. And then sit back and hold. Elbows optional. Press back up, bring that leg in and now go to a half kneeling position. So you're on one knee, the other leg is forward. Tuck your tail between your legs. So just tip the pelvis, tuck the tail. Feel a good stretch through the front of the supporting leg here. All right, now untuck your tail. And if your right leg is forward, turn left. If your left leg is forward, turn right. Hinge down into between the legs there. And then that one arm rotates up. So twist and now open and feel nice and lifted and long. Reach those fingertips toward the sky. Hold here. Open as far as you can, maybe a little further. And close that up. And then we have to repeat on the other side. So switch which knee you're on. Leg forward, first tuck your tailbone between your legs. Hold here. Okay. 
and then untuck your tail, turn, hinge down between the legs, twist, open, reach tall, hold here, open a little further if you can. Good, close that up. Now I want you to press into a standing position and stay here for a forward bend. Now in forward bend, hands on shins, hands on feet, hands on floor, whatever you can reach. Tip your tail toward the sky and your hip bones closer to your thighs. Now while you're here, bend one knee and then the other. So do a little baby march. Four, march three, march two, oh. march one. Now stay in one leg, one leg straight, one leg bent. And now switch other leg straight. Straighten both legs and then grab your elbows with the opposite hand, make a frame for your head and let the weight of your torso pull you toward the floor. Stay there, last stretch, take three deep breaths. Fill your back with air, so expand your back on each breath. Hands to the floor, bend your knees, carefully roll yourself up. We're all done for today. Yay.